Hi, my name is Dex from My Consult, and today we'll be looking at a customized plugin for AutoCount which is called Payment Voucher Approval. So this plugin enables users to key in payment voucher but will only be posted once a manager or the owner approves it. So now let's try this out. Right, so I'm logging in as a user who can only create payment voucher but cannot approve it. So let's go to cash flow entry here. Let's press a new payment voucher. Alright, so let's create say payment to tax, payment for salary, and then of course here we will select your payment method, say bank, and how much the amount, but then we press plus here, select the account code called salary. Okay, and then let's put the amount here. Let's say we pay four thousand. Okay. So once we actually press and key in the amount and we want to save the transaction, here we cannot click the button save because I don't have the approval to save it. So what we do is we just press here call hold payment and then once done, we can go back to your cash flow entry. You will not be able to see DAX and his salary payment. But what happens if you come to payment approval here, you come to the whole payment screen, you can actually see that there is a 4,000 salary here that is still pending, right? So you can see here it's pending, okay? Okay, now let's go in as admin user. So right here you can see we are in user ID admin. So let's go into payment approval. Let's go to whole payment. Now here you can actually select which payment that I would like to approve. So we can actually select multiple and tick here and then we can press approve. So let's say we want to approve both of that or you can actually choose to reject them. Alright. So once you press yes, this status has changed to approval. And if you like to check, you can even have things like here, column chooser. Come to here, approve by. You can actually pull and drag here. You can see which user is actually the one that approved that particular payment. So let's say for example, now I would like to actually post it into my account. I press here convert all right so i press convert i press yes okay it will disappear from this list and then let's go into my uh payment watcher or my cash flow entries so come up here you'll be able to see now that these two are in the payment watcher screen that means it's already being posted to your accounts and we can see what was the whole payment voucher number as well as who was the one that actually approved this Okay, so this is actually how easy it is to manage your payment approvals inside AutoCount. Do like and subscribe if you find these videos helpful. Thank you.